Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Green Country Baits here. We're going to be doing a crawfish pattern on the zombie line. This one's called the Zombie Stalker. Doing it on my favorite new bait, the Money Badger. So, let's go spray some paint. Alright, <clears throat> we got our zombie mask on here, as I call it. And so we're going to do an undertone. Start off because... We don't really have any color on the belly, but this purple, as you'll see, will kind of glow through that belly. So we're going to lay down some detail violet. sure why that's not sticking I'm gonna have to redo my redo my mask all right once we get that undertone on now we're just going to come back over with some white and cover it up Candy yellow. I'm going to really get the full effect of the candiness, obviously, with going over it with an opaque white. But I do like the. color of this particular yellow so that's what I've always used on some of my patterns I'm going to get good coverage of that yellow get the heat set it's kind of a brown orange, but I don't really want to use an orange uh, fin or anything like that. Could probably do it and get away with it. This is just the way I've done it. You can use any of those that you'd like. A good flow. Reduce the pressure down. Got that color ready. Now we need to clean out this one. We'll be right back. Okay, we got all our colors set. Should have gave that a good good enough time to, to dry a little bit. And so what we're gonna come back over with is our, our orange that we mixed up and just do a little bit of an outline.
Alright. We'll do a few of them bigger drops, then we increase the pressure and We're just looking for some random splotches. You can even dip a brush if you want and do them that way just to kind of give you an idea. I just use the splattering technique, but I want to get this one a little more orange on that bottom. Next up, we're going to do some green texturing up along the shoulders. We've got a this is a lime green. And what I've done is just went ahead and didn't completely dump out all of that lime green. And I'm going to go back over it with some of this bright green. And do some more texturing here. So now we got the black. We're going to go black eyes.
last thing. This thing we got some black splatter. Yeah, not really the last thing, but, but we're pretty close. So we're going to remove the stencil now after a heat set. Show you what our first look is. So we've got that purple. It should probably be very difficult to see, but when that light passes through it, let's see how it can give you a nice little glow transparency of the belly. Dust it. Let me get you a close up here and you guys let me know what you think of the zombie stalker. Once, I want to say once again, appreciate you guys checking out the channel. Hope you like this crawl pattern. Uh, it's quite a bit different, but it's got some really good colors in it. We, uh, we thank you, and until next week, you're in Country Bait, signing out.